Ryan's Haunts at ahappierman.com. Today's topic is drive to think. We've well, noticed I, I do a lot of these videos when I'm driving and I usually have some sort of an idea and I, I can usually start to explain it I think pretty well while I'm driving. Well obviously I have some thoughts beforehand and maybe some notes and some might have been part of a different article but I think you should when you're driving that is a good time to really uh, let your let your mind wander maybe clear start help you start to clarify uh, a thought you know a lot of times you know you've heard about putting an idea before you go to bed and then you wake up with a, the solution but do that on your drive you know have a have a thought before you get in the car let the miles roll by and you might discover the solution while you're driving. The motion, motion seems to help you think. Uh, like for example, a lot of the great thinkers from the past, they like to walk. And walking is, is in some ways it might be better than driving because it's slower, you don't got to worry about the, you know, you got to be aware while you're driving, right? But, but the, um, the movement. I think it's the main thing is the movement. You don't always want to just sit at your desk and try to puzzle out the solution to a difficult problem or sit there and wonder uh, what should I do about X, Y, and Z or so and so. Uh, sometimes if you get in the car and drive, the solutions will present themselves or you'll, you'll, you'll have some sort of insight, you'll have some good ideas, you know, you know the, the ideas you have that are pretty good, you'll flesh them out, and then some of the bad ideas, they'll kind of, they'll, they'll move on because, well, the movement helps you. So I would, uh, I would encourage you to do some driving, and, but there is a certain amount of, uh, let's say, baseline requirements for the driving. You want to be, not be under tremendous stress while you're driving, like being late for some place, yeah, then it wouldn't be a good idea to be thinking. You would want to be focusing on the drive. Or if there's like excessive traffic or dangerous conditions, well, yeah, focus, focus, focus on the drive and your safety. But you know, on a nice day, when there's not too much traffic and everything is fine, yeah, you probably can be a safe driver and come up with some good ideas and some thoughts and some clarifications and, and all of that good stuff to make your life better and if you're if, if you put it in your mind that everything you think about is going to make your life better well then when you drive things will start to come your way the thoughts and you, you may depending on on how good your memory is you may want to have some way to uh, to record those thoughts you know it, it's hard to write when you're driving you know you can pull over if you have notepad and take a few notes you know I've done that or you can get out the phone like this and talk into it or put it in your recorder and you know you don't want to lose the good ideas if you're if your if your memory is such that you have a great idea but then you lose you you lose the idea because you're busy with other with life well then what good does it do right you want to keep you want to get that ideas down on some sort of a device or paper where you can make best use of it. So the driving, yeah, if you're driving, you probably want to have your phone out like this and take notes and uh, uh, talk into it or, or, or record into it or, you know, every once in a while pull over and take some notes. You're, you're going to think pretty good. Your, your, your mind will start to... Uh, help you with this, help you with your life by the movement of the driving. Probably another thing for the drive is you probably need a good car that's comfortable and easy to drive. I guess I remember back in college and when I was a young man I, I had just junk cars and I uh, was so worried about getting to where I'm going and you know there's always problems so they're really, I didn't really, I never really had that great of ideas in those days because I was so main thing was will this car last the whole way will it start will it get me where I'm going then when I'm there and I got to turn around and go back will it make it back so you you don't want that kind of stress if you have that kind of stress with, with your car 
yeah, you're not going to have that creative idea. Even with this truck, I've had, you know, there's been a few issues here and there, and when those issues come up, yeah, you're, wor you're so worried about uh, the driving itself, you don't really have any great ideas. So you want to keep your vehicle well maintained, you want a good vehicle, comfortable, easy, safe, and all of that, that will help you think a lot better. So give the